Stuart, you told me something like interesting. I mean, you said you're, you were, you used to be a hairdresser. <laughs> is that right? Yeah, that's true. Yeah. So how did you transition from or move from like hairdressing to like coding? Interesting. Yeah, I left school at um, age 16 and took an apprenticeship in hairdressing. Um, oh, wow. I grew up in a very, very rural area of England, um, you know, where, you know, you either you kind of you kind of followed in your father's footsteps almost, you know, whatever your father did. So if your father was in the plumbing or electricity trade or bricklaying or was a lorry driver, you know, that's pretty much what happened, you know. Uh, the smart kids went off to university, but, you know, the kids that sat at the back of the classroom like me and stuff like that, you know, we we, we went, went into trades. Um, and my, father's a, my father was a carpenter, and so he always worked with his hands and things. And so I... I, I, I I went into hairdressing as a, as a trade, and I did that for fifteen years. Oh wow! Um, believe it or not, I was the master of the cutthroat shave. I could wield the cut. I could re- wield a cutthroat razor, you know, quite well. And considering that I haven't shaved myself in <laughs> a great you know, number this might, of years. This might be a weird question, but can you give me a trim at Cisco Live? Set up yeah, a little absolutely. Booth? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> set up a set up a little cutting show, but. What's going on guys? Uh, welcome back to This Is IT. This will be episode two. I, I am Chuck or Network Chuck and we got David Bomble here as well. Say hi David. Hey everyone. Good to be back for the second episode and hopefully you're enjoying these these videos and you know the show. As always, let us know what you think. Sorry Chuck, took over there. You go for it. Yeah, you always do that, man. Well, that's why that's why we like each other because we always you know get into these fights. <laughs> well, anyways, guys, I hope you got your coffee ready. We have someone pretty special on the show today. Um, his name is Stuart. Stuart, what's your last name, Stuart? Or you don't have to give your last yeah. name. Big Evil Beard. Big Evil Beard. Oh, okay, yeah. Forget his name. It's not Stuart. It's a uh, Big Evil Beard, and uh, he works for Cisco. You know, actually, I'll let him tell us a bit about who he is and why why he's important. Because I think he's pretty important. Uh, go ahead, Stuart. <laughs> take you. it away. I don't know about the important. Yeah, my name is Stuart Clark. I work for Cisco on the uh, Cisco Developer Program. I've been with Cisco for seven years now. Um, I joined the uh, Developer Program Cisco DevNet around 15, 16 months ago. And it's been an awesome ride. I get to meet really cool people and go to all the events around the world and hang out with all the cool people like Chuck and David. So it's pretty awesome. You work for Cisco and you work in a very like unique uh, part of Cisco because it's kind of like the the forefront of Cisco. It's it's the new stuff. How did you get on that? T- have you always been on that team at Cisco, or how did you get to that point? 